Hey guys, this is it for iOS Hacker. In this video, we are going to take a look at the new Bang case by Bitmo Lab. This is an iPhone case with a twist. What's the twist you might ask? Well, the Bang case comes with a bang, the customizable bang button that is. This dedicated button acts similar to action button of iPhone 15 Pro, but better, as it allows them to perform different actions by pressing the bang button. Let's talk about the bang button in a bit and take a look at the case itself. The bank case features a unique transparent design that shows the inside of the case to the user. The case looks absolutely awesome and made me a fan as soon as I looked at it for the first time. Let's take out the packaging so we can look at the case clearly. On the back of the case, you get the bank case branding. A look at the inside components of the case, magnets for the MagSafe wireless charging compatibility and more. Here's a clearer look at the case's design in broad daylight. I have to say that the case looks even better when the lighting conditions are good. On the right side of the case you get the bang button and on the left you get the action button and volume keys. You also get this nice let's retrieve the joy in tech gadgets motto of Bitmo Lab along with the Bitmo Lab logo which looks cool. Here's the look at the case with iPhone 15 Pro Max inside and here's the bang button. Now let's take a look at how the bang button works. For this demo, I have set up bang button in such a way that when I press it once, the control center appears and when I press the button twice, the camera app opens. Pressing the bang button is quite convenient as you don't have to apply much force to press it. It might take some getting used to, but once you get used to it, it is very convenient to use. The location of the bang button is also quite good. It is ideally located right below the power button and in my opinion, it is located at a much better place than the action button of iPhone 15 Pro Max. Setting up the bang case with your iPhone is really easy. It connects with your iPhone via Bluetooth. So the first time you put it on, make sure you go to the settings app, head to the Bluetooth section and there add bang case to your Bluetooth devices. After the bang case has been set up with your device, you have to go to the accessibility section there tap on touch and then go to the assistive touch settings make sure you turn on the assistive touch feature of your iPhone once assistive touch is active go to the devices section and there you will find the bang case tap on it and there you can configure the button 1 and button 2 button 1 is when you press the bang button once and button 2 is when you press the bang button twice you can assign different actions to each click type for example you can set a different action when you press the button once and you can set up another action when you press the button twice. For example, in my demo, I set up my device in such a way that when I click on the bang button once, the control center screen will appear and if I tap on the button twice, the camera app will open. In addition to single press and double press, users can also assign actions to the long press action. So when you long press on the bang button, you can trigger an action of your choice. In addition to assigning different system actions to the bang button, you can also assign shortcuts to it. For example, you can assign your favorite shortcut to the bang button and when you press the button in that way, that shortcut will automatically get triggered. This is similar to how you can assign shortcuts to the action button and trigger them with the action button of iPhone 15 Pro. As I have mentioned earlier, the bang button connects to the iPhone via Bluetooth. It also needs to be charged with its custom magnetic cable that comes with it. This is perhaps the only drawback of this case. At this point, I am not sure how long the battery will last on a single charge. It has a 200mAh battery, so it should last a long time. This case also comes with MagSafe compatibility, so you can stick your MagSafe charger to the iPhone and charge it without any effort. Sadly, the MagSafe charger won't charge the case. All in all, I am very impressed with the bank case. It is a very good looking case that provides good protection to your iPhone and offers an extra feature that you won't find in any other case. The bank case is going to be available for iPhone 15 Pro, 15 Pro Max, iPhone 14 Pro and 14 Pro Max. Bitmo Lab is currently running a Kickstarter campaign for the bank case and they have already achieved their pledge goal. If you hurry up and pledge early, then you can get a super early bird discount and get the bank case for $39.99. Link to the Kickstarter campaign is shared in the description of this video. So guys, this was our look at the bank case. If you like this video, do hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more content like this. This was Zay for iOS Hacker and I will catch you in our next video.